to analyze the efficiency of LSU's mechanical engineering flowchart by naming one class or lab that you think is not beneficial and what its replacement should be for students in order to receive a better education. Okay. Hi, my name is uh, Sam Chartino, and my question was, I need to analyze the flowchart for us ME students and pick a lab that needs to be replaced or changed. Huh. So, I've only taken this lab, a main instrumentation lab right now, and then the materials lab, 3701, which I thought was useless because we really didn't do anything important out of lab, or the TA kind of did everything for us, and I didn't really see the point of it. Kind of based on what a lot of kids do coming out of LSU, like a lot of kids go either work in the automotive industry or in the oil and gas industry, and I didn't see the point of a fracture lab that we don't really use a whole lot, or hardness testing, which I don't really see being used a whole lot. Um, a lab that I would put in its place, so I think a fluids lab would be pretty cool to use. Um, I don't think we have one that I know of, and I know they've talked about using having a fluids lab along with the fluids class, and I think that would be pretty beneficial, beneficial to any students who are going into the oil and gas industry or working in chemical plants and stuff like that and learning more about how pipe flow and maybe flow into heat exchangers and stuff like that actually works and how that's actually affected in real world, real world, world scenarios, or a lab more based on, because I, like I know a lot of kids work in the oil and gas industry, more based on a production side for mechanical engineers. I think that would be really beneficial for everyone to get hands-on experience in that. Uh, kids who have not had in, opportunities to have internships or kids who have had internships in that kind of field would actually get to work on it more. So I think that would be a lot more beneficial than a basic materials lab. So that's mainly what I would change about our flowchart. Thank you.